There we go. How's it going, everybody? Hitting the river today by myself, and I'm gonna try out the Z-Man jackhammer. I got the half ounce. Oh, the staple got me. B height delight, and I'm gonna throw on some other minnows and the watermelon short chartreuse tail. They're the three inch. I'll actually show you. I got it rigged up. It's supposed to be a hot one today, but it is about 60 degrees out right now and a little cold, so my voice is off. But there it is. There is the setup, the jackhammer. I fished the Project Z a lot. I've never used the, the Z-Man minnows as a trailer before. I usually use it like a craw, but it starts super easy. And it's got some pretty awesome action. And actually, right at the launch, I took a few practice casts to dial in my bait caster and I had a swipe on a smaller one. So I'm hoping this is the money. A little bit more than I usually spend for a bait, so we'll see if the jackhammers are worth their 16 to $18 asking price. Let's paddle out here to the river and we'll uh, get fishing. That's a fish. That's a fish, right? Oh, that's a good fish. Come on. Get out of the reeds. Oh yeah, nice small mouth. We got a bigger net today. Helping or hurting. Oh yeah, nice small mouth. That's been a been a while since I've been on the river. The first fish on my Z-Man jackhammer. So he's definitely a uh, man. I tell you what, I gotta get used to this river fishing again. Look at that, nice fish. The dangle, dirty dangle, what is that? A little pike. We don't want him anyway. Check my line here real quick. We're good. A lot of floating debris here. ease into it. Let's see if I can get a better cast ending up again. I actually pulled one out of here last year fishing with my buddy Dave. Let's see if anybody's home today. There we go, someone's home. Somebody's home. I don't think he's the only one over here either. Boy, they know how to avoid a net. Early morning action on the jackhammer. 
Like I said, I pulled one out over here last year that was way nicer. These are nice fish, but let's see if we can get some bigger ones. There we go. There we go. Stay on. Just make sure I don't run into anything in this current here. Nice fish though. There we got the power pole working. I'm just gonna thumb this guy here. If I can. Oh yeah, he's hooked. I got my seven, what is this thing? Oh, it's like a 7.3 medium heavy, super long for the kayak, but I actually tripped up and broke my regular rod. Boy, they can fight in this current. There, nice sunshine, a sunshine shot of this guy. Get some drag back out, there we go. And it's chomped. There, now we actually did it right. That's a nice fish. All right, one more look at you. There he goes. I saw a guy come out. Get out of the weeds. It's actually pretty nice. It's actually pretty nice when I'm in some serious current though. Got power pole down. I think this guy's hooked. I think he's hooked. You know what? I'll just make it easy on myself. There. Yeah, it's actually a pretty nice one. My rod is way too long for the kayak right now. Got that thing chomped. When I'm finding them, they're definitely hitting it. Number four of the day is not a bad number. I'll let you go right away though. There he goes. There we go. Oh my gosh. That might be a muskie. What is that? No, oh, it's Pike. I saw him laying in the weeds and he actually hit. He's got a lot of scars on him though. Don't take my jackhammer. 
Dude, you're skinny. You are a big headed skinny pike. That's a long one, but boy, he's, he's thin. Uh, can I grab him? Okay, I got a death grip on you, I think. Yeah, my death grip isn't very good. Do not wreck my jackhammer. There we go. Right in the snout. Look how thin this guy is. Dude, you need a meal. Cheeseburger. I thought you might have been a musky back up in here, but I didn't go right away. Double check my stink line. Yeah, they stink. Well, that was cool. I saw him come out of the weeds and I cast and he still came for it. There we go, little guy. All right, duder, hold up. Hold up, dude, I'll let you go. Oh yeah, you got hooked. There's a muskie in this area and I don't want to spook him too bad. See if I can actually get him to chase my chatterbait. There we go. What is that? A little smally? I thought I was bumping the ground. You just kept taking my tail. There's a few in here. Really, I think the problem is the river is so low that it's hard for the big ones to find any place to hide. And those deep pools are full of fish, but they're the wrong kind, except for that muskie. Oh my gosh, he missed. There we go. Oh yeah, my bail set. That's a nice one. Stay on. I saw him take it. I missed so many today. That's more my fault than anything. Some are small. That last one came out and just completely airballed it. And come on. That's a nice fish. Get the line out of the way here. Nice fish. Choke that Z-Man chatterbait. That might be the last one of the day. I've seen uh, red horse suckers, I've seen carp, I've seen big, buff, big mouth buffalo, I've seen musky. Uh, I have caught smallmouth and pike. So there's a lot of uh, fish in this river. The wind, you can see in the background, I'm actually down in a calm spot, but we got about a 30 mile an hour wind and it's gonna approach 95 degrees. Let's do this. Get that good looking guy on camera. 
So I am pretty close to a launch. My odds of catching one more, maybe. Uh, if you see then more of this video, there's one more yet. Um, overall, let's get this thing up here again. Incredible, incredible action with that uh, Minnows trailer on the Z-Man jackhammer. I will put a coupon code in the description and probably something in the beginning of the video too so you guys can get 10% uh, off and save at the website. Other than that, that's gonna be my episode for the day unless I catch one more. Thanks for following along. It's just a short float today because it's super hot. I'm always super busy and I actually pulled a muscle in my back. So I'm struggling a little bit kayaking, uh, not going real hardcore, but I just gotta get out. It's been too long. So thanks for watching. See you guys next time.